actually what really happened to my son. Now she says she's even more hurt. Weeks after Rahman's death, this photo was leaked out. The date, August 8th, the same as Rahman's death. We've blurred the body, and News 4 has also chosen to conceal the co-op officer, since no wrongdoing has been determined. He's wearing gloves, holding onto the arm of the body, and giving a thumbs up. In your mind, is there any reasonable explanation for what that officer was doing? No. Because when, when they come to a call, to me, they're supposed to be there to help and protect. Not doing what he did with thumbs up with a smirk on his face. State's attorney, Antonio Romanucci, agrees. It's hideous. Uh, the, the implications of this photograph are, are just absolutely astronomical. He believes something isn't right. I've seen thousands and thousands of forensic uh, photographs. Okay. As cops, you take another L for this one. I don't have anything against cops. I know a couple videos I did some things about cops, but yeah, I do some about everybody. You know, um, I keep it real. I speak the truth. Um, y'all need to do a background check on these cops, emotional wise and. Personality test is not enough. You need, you need to really test these cops. What kind of cop would take a picture, a selfie, or a picture period with a dead guy, dead black guy? That's that's crazy. I haven't even seen this on CNN or nothing. It it probably been on CNN, but like I said, CNN they they don't um. They don't never give you all the information, you know, most of the stuff that I, I see or I collect most of my information from Facebook, you know, because Facebook is the news, you know, people want to spread the truth on Facebook, and it's, it's very sickening, man, you know, it's, once again, it's, it's horrifying, her, her son dead, the guy was 28, young, and they say it, it may was a overdose but the lady don't know what happened to her son you know they would they every time a black guy get killed or here he can be white they always say it's a suicide the cover up things you know so you have to look deep into that you have to be careful you have to be very careful about calling calling the cops nowadays and even trusting them like I said there's still some good cops out there some good cops and there's some bad cops and it seems like the world is surrounded with more bad cops. But hey, this video brief once again. Um, subscribe, comment, let me know what y'all think. I'm out.